Good afternoon. This big winter and big runoff has water levels rising quickly at Elephant Butte Lake, and that's a problem for people who are leaving their RVs on the beach to claim a spot for the big Memorial Day weekend. News 13's Fernando Lopez shows us. People are getting caught off guard. My truck wasn't even in the water. Oh, wow. Right now, the front tires would be in the water. Elephant Butte Park officials say some campers are leaving RVs unattended ahead of one of the busiest times on the lake, Memorial Day weekend. Uh, two feet, of, two, to, two and a half feet a week. Park officials say right now the lake is 14 feet higher than this time last year. The rising water levels sure to come as a surprise for some unsuspecting visitors who set up earlier this week to hold a spot on the beach, then left. Some of the people are going to have issues when, when they come down here. They're going to find their, their uh, trailers really close to the water, maybe even in the water. Park officials say it's not only a bad idea to leave RVs so close to the shore, they say it's also against park rules. They say camps cannot be left unattended for more than 24 hours. You know, the previous summers, the water would be going down. Boating officer Salvador Gonzalez says water levels have gone up 8 to 10 feet in the last month from spring runoff. And Elephant Butte is the fullest it's been since 2008. You need to park a little bit, at least 30 feet from the edge of the water. Manuel Flores set up camp today. He says this year's high water levels are hard to miss. Oh, yes, definitely. Uh, the past three years, I believe, was pretty dry out here. This weekend, park officials expect 100,000 visitors, about 20,000 more than last year. Fernanda Lopez, KRQE, News 13. And with more water, there's less beach space. Park officials say they do not tow the RVs as the water starts inching closer. People park who park near the water do so at their own risk.